We begin with possible cases of the coronavirus continuing to pop up around the U.S. Two cases have now been confirmed in the states, one in Washington state and the other in Illinois. The CDC is currently monitoring 63 patients across 22 states for more possible outbreaks. A lot of folks have contact, contacted us here at KTVB saying they've seen people with the symptoms and they're wondering if it spread to Idaho. Our Misty Inglet spoke with multiple health experts about this today and she found out some answers answers for us. Misty. Well, Gretchen, the consensus is that yes, many people in Idaho probably have been diagnosed with coronavirus, but it's not that infamous strain from Wuhan, China. There are many different types or strains, if you will, of the virus, and the majority are seen multiple times each winter. Coronavirus has killed 26 people in China and infected nearly 900 others worldwide. However, the CDC says the threat to the U.S. is low, with only two confirmed cases stateside so far. The specific strain that has health officials worried was first detected in Wuhan City, China. However, local health experts say there are multiple strains of coronavirus, many of which surface in the U.S. every winter. A coronavirus is just a, a pretty common virus. And there are a handful of those viruses that regularly circulate um, and cause just respiratory infections. In fact, you've probably had coronavirus multiple times in your life. Coronavirus can ca just cause the common cold. Um, usually it's a mild to moderate illness. Meaning many people can show the symptoms, sore throat, runny nose, fever, cough, etc. But St. Al says while many in the U.S. do pick up a coronavirus, it's probably not the version you think. In reality, the people who would be at risk for the novel coronavirus from China are people who have recently traveled to Wuhan City, China, or have been in really close contact with somebody who um, has recently traveled and is ill. Um, otherwise, you're not at risk for this new virus. So if symptoms are similar, what's the difference between the common and novel strains? Really, the, the difference is that it's new um, and we don't know a lot about it yet. Local hospitals and physicians are on the lookout for the new strain. And if someone presents here at any of our facilities or urgent cares or practices, um, we've guided our clinicians to take a really, really thorough travel history um, and symptom history. And St. L says if there is a connection to Wuhan, China with anyone who presents those symptoms of the virus, then tests are sent to the CDC for confirmation. Now, as far as Idaho goes, the Department of Health and Welfare tells me there are no current cases of that Wuhan strain in the state. And we are not one of those 22 states the CDC is watching for potential cases. Gretchen. All right, Missy. And if untreated, it should be noticed, health, uh, noted. Health experts say the common coronavirus can sometimes turn into something more serious like pneumonia or a severe respiratory infection. So if you have concerns, please go see a doctor.